everybody. Cindy A. Lewis here. Welcome. If you're new, um, I invite you to put hi below in the comments so that I can meet you. If you're part of my YouTube family, welcome back. I'm so glad you're here for this quick and easy, fun, what do I do with paper towels that were under my coffee dyed paper? All right, so we're actually going to take these and create some really fun embossed pages, designs that we can use with our journals. So you can see I have quite a lot to choose from here. And so I'm just going to take one set here. We're just going to pull this apart. I love upcycling. It is it's super fun and so easy to do. So I did say emboss and that is what I intend to do. So I need water and an embossing folder and I need my paper towel that I'm going to upcycle. So let's just, um, let's just go with, uh, the See, let's just go with these stones for now. This is a 3D embossing folder. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our water and we're gonna spritz um, the paper towels. So I wanna spritz um, both sides just to make sure it gets all over. So I want my paper towels to be spritzed, not soaking wet, but just wet. All right. Now, like I said, I love upcycling. I love using anything over that would have normally been put in the trash. And these paper towels are actually from my Dollar Tree junk journal when I coffee dyed paper. Now this is not as wet here, so I'm just gonna do that. And I'm gonna run this through the machine and show you how it comes out. All right, are you ready? Let me flip it over this way so you can see. And there it is. And you want to use four sheets. And then you can, after it dries, then you can come back over it. You can deckle the edges, tear the edges. And then you can take ink and go over it. But look at that. Is that amazing? Let's do another. All right. I'm so excited to show you this. So this is another 3D embossing folder. This one is the studded leather. So this is the folder here. And I'm just gonna take my four sheets that I've already cut, take my spritzing bottle, and just get water on both sides. And this other one is drying over here and it is looking so amazing. All right, are you ready? Look at that. Look at that. That is incredible. All right, next we're going to use a regular embossing folder. Those were 3D. This is called the Flutter by Collection Embossing Folder Summer Sprigs. And it is a long one. Look at that. Oh, that's going to be pretty. All right, so I'm just going to put this underneath because I'm getting my... my um, getting everything wet, my table. All right, so we're just gonna go over again. Okay, are you ready for this? Look at that. Oh my goodness. Now it does deboss on the other side as well. <laughs> Isn't that beautiful? All right, just a couple more, humor me. All right, here we go. And here is one, and look how deep that imprint is. And then the deboss side. Oh, this is the deboss side. Well, look at that. Nice. And then look at this one. How beautiful. How much fun it is to save something you would throw in the trash and make some beautiful pieces that you can use for your junk journals or uh, your art pieces, whatever you want to do. Anyway, thanks so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed this quick and easy craft. These will have to dry before I can play with them anymore, but I have a lot to upcycle and it's going to be great fun. So thanks so much for watching.